Hey everybody, welcome to MacTastic Sight. I'm your host, Mac Trammell. Today we're going to be talking about aliens, because I like to talk about aliens, because they make me feel funny inside. But you know. But uh, yeah, we're going to talk about aliens, and we're going to look at some photos and some uh, videos and try to figure out well, what's going on here. You know, what, what, are they here? Are they not here? You know, I'm going to do more videos on them, on them as well. And, uh, and uh, I think I think that that they had a hearing recently. And it was uh, from uh, it was uh, uh, David uh, Gresh and uh, Commander Fravor and uh, another fella, um, uh, David uh, Gresh. David Courage, Courage. I don't know. I think that's the other guy's name. But uh, but they had to go in front of a hearing and tell their testimony about UFOs and stuff they know about it in the government to the state senate uh, to the United States Senate okay now that is a big freaking deal baby <laughs> a big deal because now they're interested and they want to know what what's the government been doing what's going on man uh, I mean, hey, is there aliens? You, you guys know anything about this shit? I mean, and, and they're going to get down to the bottom of it. Especially this uh, a certain uh, senator that's on the uh, committee. Uh, uh, he, I can't remember his name. But he wears, he's a gray-haired cat. But he's taking a lot of interest in it. And he's going to get down to the bottom of things. But well, while he's doing that, we are going to be watching these UFO videos. So, with all that said and done, let's do this. Okay, this first video is taken out of the glowing object over Marion, Texas on August 26, 2020, UFO sighting news. I guess this made the news here, but uh, this first one here is, uh, is quite interesting. We have a, an orb, it looks like, just, just hanging out in the sky. Uh, let's watch some more over here. This is the same orb? I mean, it looks like it's moving. Yeah, it, it looks like it's moving. But I need to clear that camera up, bro. I know, but that camera needs to be cleared up. Holy fuck. But uh, that's crazy. Okay, now the second one is more of the world's best UFO and UAP, UAP footage, video footage. Uh, this is from UFO Conspiracy. Please go to their website, subscribe. Let's see what they got going on. The truth is out. Is something. Can't say it, so that's a bummer. <laughs> UFOs are still being filmed all over the world. Some of the footage is good. Yeah, some of it's good. Some of it. While other footage is, footage is bad. Yeah, I agree. What are you about to see is no, not thanks to the rule. Wow, check that out. I've seen this one, yeah, it explodes. Now, I want to, let's, let's go frame by frame. And I want to see this thing explode. What you, while other footage, UFOs are still being filmed all over the world. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. Okay. Now, it tries to pull up, I, I think. Oh, no, it goes five seconds every five seconds. My bad. But look at that thing. It, it explodes on the ground, though. Boom. Boom. It bounced one time. Yeah, I remember that. And then it, it, it 
couldn't take the second bounce and it incinerated. And you know what? It, what that incineration right there reminds me of? It, it reminds me of when uh, they talk about um, uh, the UFO in Roswell, New Mexico. Uh, they say the debris went everywhere. And that reminds me of that. And, and, it, and that just kind of gives validation a little bit to, it, to a story. Uh, to uh, Mac Brazel, uh, the guy that founded the debris, that just gives him some validation that uh, you know uh, there was a lot of debris because that looked like that exploded and incinerated. Let's see what's next here. Let's see if we can get a good pause on it. Yeah, that's uh, that's another orb that I just can't explain these orbs at night. But they they got a good shot of it. Very good. It's coming this way. Yeah, it's looking slow. Yeah, that's crazy. That is crazy. I'm just trying to figure out how it got over here that quick because we were ten miles from here and it was way on the other side of the road. First time we wow. saw it. Wow. That thing must be cruising. I know it's just a light, but just imagining it's what dark. it could be is what makes people excited. What it could be. People wow. want aliens. I don't care who you are. You're going to say, I want aliens because life is boring right now. And we need some excitement in our lives. Don't you think? Yes, sir. <laughs> This looks like some f up camera footage here. Really can't do nothing with it. I mean, look at all this crap in it. And that's the only thing that's really... I mean, you can almost mistake in this crap for it and that crap. And that right there. That is not a good capture at all. I mean, I can't even see him. You know, back it up. Maybe I could see something, but shit, damn, son, your 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 camera sucks. I mean, your camera sucks. If that's you out there that can film this shit, good lord, smack yourself. <laughs> just just wail off and just let that sucker rip. Just, that ought to straighten you out. There you go. Look, see, he told you. Now we can see it a little better. Now I can see it moving. They're moving, yeah. Yes, they are moving. I have no idea what those are either. But they are far, far way up there, buddy. And they're, they're right outside Earth's atmosphere, I believe. I would say. Just disappeared. I do believe that there's uh, openings too that that, 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 they, that they travel through to get from one point to another. That's why you can see them and then they're gone sometimes because they got portals that they can switch on and off and jump in and take off to another uh, part of the galaxy or even another part of the world. Now I've seen this one and now I want to pause this. Let me see here. I'm glad they slow mo because, oh yeah, because see, look you here. This thing is not round, um, and it's got like a octagon. Now that they zoomed in, an octagon look to it. Let's see here. So, and you can also see like a a a substance around around this sucker. It's like. Oh, it's like around the rim right here. You can see, like, it, it don't look right, right? See that? Well, that's because of what they use for their gravity uh, propulsion. It creates a, a, let's see, I'll show you. It creates a, uh, like a, a balloon around 
this object and carries it where it wants. Okay, look at this. Whoa, 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 whoa. See, just like that one. Now, when they want to move like that, when they would just want to move, okay, yeah, that's a good example right there. Very good example. Okay, now when they just want to move like that, they 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 barely got their system on, uh, barely got it ramped up their motor, you could say, because lack of a better word I can't think of, but their power system that helps them glide and stuff, uh, create uh, their own gravity is uh, um, <clears throat> they turn it on, they can turn it up and turn it down, and when they're just cruising around like this, and we can see them. They just barely got it turned up. Now, when they have it full blast and they they take off, they go belly first. That's the reason I'm telling you this. Is because when they're just zooming around like this, and this is their slow mode, you know, basically, uh, this hover mode they call it. Uh, they're they're but when they take off, they're 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 belly first and they take off. Uh, here's an example. I want you to see here. Okay, that guy takes off, okay? Pshoom. Belly first, okay. There's an example. There's another UFO that's going belly first, okay? Now, he's going, it looks like he's going this way, okay? And he's going belly first. As you can see right there, belly first. Uh, I have no idea what the tops is right here, but you can sure see it really well. But yeah, they're going belly first, and uh, let's get rid of this. Let's see what they got here. Okay, this looks like this is night vision. A belly first, belly first. Slow down, it ain't, it ain't gonna be no different. No different. Slow down. Your bone head. What the hell's wrong with you? Well, you got manure for your brain or something? <laughs> <laughs> yep. Still looks the same. Slow down. Appreciate your time, though. Thanks. How about you just step back and smack yourself? What was, what were we looking at? I don't see shit. Where? That? Are we in a plane? Oh, we're in a plane. Okay. Okay, we're cruising in a plane. We're look. Holy shit. There it went, buddy. Slow down. Yeah, I would hope so. Look at that sucker. Look at that. What? It looks like... Okay. You're going the wrong way. Okay, now. Slow down. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. There we is. See that? It, oh, there's two. There was two of them. Wow, that was cool, man. Whoa, look at that. It looks like the moon. Look at that. Would you look at that? It does. It looks like the damn moon. I wonder if I can crop this circle. Loop. Copy. Look at that. That was amazing. Look how bright that is. We got another one. Sure do. Wow. Those are amazing captures. That one is amazing. Look how bright that is. Oh, wow. There you go. There's Tic Tac. Drops down. Takes off. Yeah. Kyung.
drops down to to its wait a minute hold up hold up this is a fake now i'm gonna show you why i know this is a fake because the camera takes off before the item does okay before you see it come through here you're going to see the camera start to pan first see the camera starting to pan first that's a fake because the editor knew that that was going to be there and so he went in and took off with the with the editing and press play and that's the reason that's that took off before the object is so this is a fake come on show us what you got oh that's amazing it's amazing look at that look at that It's gorgeous. I seen something similar like that when I was a kid. What we got here? Oh wow. Oh wow. Look at that. It's taken off off the ground. Look at the snow and stuff coming up. It taken off. Wow. I've seen this one. Yeah, this one goes right into the woods here. The man even walked over. Walked over to, to where this goes in and everything. And uh, sees it's just, an, it just, there's nothing there. It's just a, 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 a piece of a, a rock. Big rock. <laughs> I'm serious. Yeah, right through there. But he stood right. Ah, oh, damn it! Could you could have showed you? Okay, what what we got here? Okay, now this looks real to me so far. I mean that if that's the Tic Tac video, basically, and it's somebody somebody got some footage of it. That sucker is cruising. Okay, there's another one that's cigar. We get you get a lot of those cigar shaped UFOs. Huh. Look at him go. Speedy Gonzalez there. Oh, two of them. Or is there just this one slowed down? We'll get a good picture over here. There we go. That's a nice little. Looks like a spear of some sort, don't it? Oh my. Look at that. Looks like it just took a bunch of stuff. See that? See that underneath it? Or that could be the. See the glow around it? See that? Like a little haze around it? You can see it if you look real closely. But uh, that's what keeps it up in the air. That's what it uh, defies gravity with, is that system. It's like a, it covers them like a force field. More likely that one was getting water. Hello and welcome to All Top Fives. 
I did another Old video on the top UFO five photos. oldest UFO photographs in existence, but okay. today I'm sharing what I believe to be the top five most intriguing and interesting videos of UFOs. All they could right. well all be hoaxes, or they could, could all be genuine. Whatever you believe, have a look at these. Number five, the Number Norway five. Spiral UFO. Okay. On the 9th of December 2009, thousands of people in North Norway and some of Sweden now, witnessed these, one of the most bizarre celestial incidents I've ever come these, across. I just don't... I, I don't know. This is... I mean, it's obviously coming from somewhere. I, I just... Oh, that scared the dog shit out of me. Oh, it was my phone. Dang. I was like, what the hell? Is something going on outside? Is there a wreck or something? <laughs> Damn. All right. All right. Wake up, Mac. Uh, yeah. So th I think this is coming from something from the ground, obviously, huh? This isn't a video effect or CGI. That's actually what appeared in the night sky, captured on film by several people and in countless photographs by others. For nearly three minutes, a bright blue light swept across the night sky from behind a mountain, expanded outwards, and then stopped and created a perfect spinning spiral like, of light. After spiraling know, outwards, like the light expanded doorway. and disappeared, leaving what looked like a portal like a or a wormhole at the end yeah. of a tunnel of light. Boom. A That's truly when they spectacular go in and, go out. and they at get the same time, terrifying it. event that left many spin Scandinavians it, spin wondering. Spin it, spin it, then, Initially unexplained by the baffled meteorologists, come in, come suggestions that this was a wormhole opening, See, a strange open. fireball meteor, an alien spacecraft, or a new Northern Lights variation cropped up. However, the Russians put forward an official explanation the following See, day, stating that spinning. it was a failed shh, missile shh, test. Shh, shh. The boom. missile had traveled into the outer no, atmosphere, sorry. where it malfunctioned. Put no missile test. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, pal. That's just not going to happen. Putting it into a spin and generating a large... See, look at, look at that. Look at that. That's, that is an opening, my friend. That is an opening. That is a portal to something. Cloud and spiral uh -huh, of light uh -huh. before disappearing. Yep, it is. Some conspiracy theorists dismiss this Russian explanation as a government cover-up and choose to believe that it was extraterrestrial life instead. Yes. Whatever you it's believe, not there's no I'm, doubt. I'm, it's not extraterrestrial. It It is from... It is definitely from us. We're doing this, I believe. And this, look but this opening, was, at least for a short time, up. one of the most incredible UFOs ever witnessed yeah. or captured on video. That is amazing. Number four. The Mexican four, Air bro. Force UFOs. On the 5th of March 2004, the Mexican Air Force was carrying out a patrol in a military jet checking yeah, for I've drug smugglers. One. The onboard infrared camera suddenly picked up 11 spheres yeah, that should, appeared to now, be moving extremely... Now, let me explain extreme. something here. They, they don't explain this. But, now, if these were planes or, or helicopters, okay? They would have a tail way back here, okay? And they'd be shaped like a helicopter. And you'd see it very clearly. And the reason is, you'd see it very clearly, is because it won't be white. It will be black. The color of their plane will be a kind of a grayish black. Now, these are pure white, which means they're very, very cold. Okay? Now, when they're black, that means they're very, very hot. So, these are very, very cold orbs. Okay? Now, exactly what you're looking at is what they are is a round orb that is glowing. ...quickly and in somewhat irregular fashion. Their bright glow on the infrared film suggests that they were very hot indeed. Very hot. Did I say cold? Okay, I'm sorry. Very hot. My apologies. Got that backwards. Mistakes happen. Don't punish me. But yeah, and see underneath the glow? That's because they're traveling in some kind of orb, like, substance that 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 they can uh, commute, uh, that they can the gravity they can create their own gravity. That means they can go anywhere they want. You know, you know. I'm going to translate for you. 
Yeah. Holy shit! The truly what weird thing those? about these 11 UFOs is that they were only picked up on the infrared camera. The military personnel were not I'll able to see them at all with the naked eye, and the objects were completely invisible to radar sweeps done both by the plane and by ground control. The credibility of this ground video is very high, as the armed forces aren't likely to misreport information and definitely not stage hoaxes. Something, something, the only plausible on. explanation put forward is that I these lights the were oil that. platform flares 150 miles away in the sea. This would explain why the infrared light was captured, but the humans were unable to see it, and why radar picked up Put nothing. Mm, whether this is a reasonable on. explanation or not is difficult to decide, as there are a lot of assumptions and liberties taken with it. All I can say for certain is that this is one of the best videos of what seem to be UFOs, unidentified yeah, flying it, objects, awesome. around. Boom. Number 3. Houston, Three. Texas UFOs. Houston, Texas. Mass sightings Ladies are more down. credible as UFO sightings go because it greatly reduces the chance of it being a forgery and the multiple viewing angles lessen the chance that the object or objects are just a trick of the light. That's the case in this video the from the 11th of August 2014 in Show Houston, me. Texas. What we can see is very bright lights against the clouds in a circle formation uh, which seems to it. keep rearranging itself very, very quickly. This oh, appears to have been the there? only video that I can find, but there were some photos taken by others in different areas. Each of these ah, photographs see, shows the see. clear circle formation, yes, some with a light circle. in the centre of the circle, and some observant. with lights either side of the circle. Well, what kind of no one has given much it? of a reasonable explanation as to what these lights what could the possibly shit, be. They're definitely not military aircraft, nor are they balloons. I mean, it just makes There's me also the question as to whether the lights were individual objects at a distance, so. or whether the lights were attached to something otherwise invisible, much like Tell a flying man, saucer a lot flying closer. Like All that. questions and, and no answers at all with this one, I'm afraid, but it easily makes my top five for that very Cocked reason. Number two. Number two. Nellis Test Range UFO. In November 1994, on the Nellis Test Range in the USA, the military yep. was testing a remote-controlled radar tracking system gotcha. and captured the following footage of a UFO. Okay, I don't know. That's... I don't know. I don't know, man. It's a strange one. Hell, and certainly, I don't know, the air traffic brother. controllers and operators discussing it live in the video are just Tell as baffled. The captain, they suggest it could be a helo, slang for a helicopter or indeed a balloon, but very quickly they dismiss these claims. Well, the UFO shooting. itself seems to change shape constantly, or certainly rotate in strange ways, though at such low resolution and with the sun Sorry, making so an entrance into the video, a lot of the definition is blown out. A really helpful addition to this footage is, is the on-screen radar tracking information. It Round First orb. portion of the video, the object is supposed to be travelling at around 40 miles per hour, around 10 miles away. Around 20 seconds in, the radar claims that the object accelerates very quickly from around 60 miles an hour to 660 miles an hour in only 10 seconds. Then That's it slows down. Mother. It does this all again before decelerating. Look at that. That is wicked looking, man. To around 125 miles per hour. Then, at just over a minute in, it suddenly speeds up again to over 700 miles per hour, gaining altitude rapidly as well. It passes in front of the sun at an altitude of around 11,000 feet and heads away, still climbing at over 200 miles per hour. This information, if the radar was functioning correctly and has been interpreted correctly, is incredible and really yeah, helps you put into perspective how unusual the flight so path is, and behaviour of this UFO miles. was. Unfortunately, the blurred monochrome footage is all we have on this particular sighting, and there were no other witnesses. It's still wonderful footage though. Although That's Nellis Test Range has been there. confirmed to test new military flight technologies, I have trouble believing anything man-made in 1994 or even modern day could travel in such a way. Number one, Number one, the Turkey UFO case. The this is one of my UFO personal case. favorite series of UFO videos of I've all time. In 2007, 2008 and 2009, a UFO was spotted over the Sea of Marmara in Turkey, and the sightings ah, see, were repeated yeah, yeah, and captured by one. many people Amazing during that time. Capture. The best Amazing. footage, in my opinion, comes from a night watchman, Yalkin Yalman, 
sorry for the pronunciation, who was responsible for looking after a building on the shore of the sea. Yalman's footage is the best of the lot, and some of the best UFO footage ever taken. I've extracted some of the best bits for you, but the full versions are available on the YouTube channel Turkey UFO Incident. Keep I an mean, eye on the times and dates capture. stamped on the footage though, it shows how long these sightings went on for. Dang. I think the best thing about this footage is the clarity of the object in question. It's clearly defined, giving you a sense of the material it's made of, the angles at which it's formed, and the structure of the object. Over the course of the different films, you can see some definite similarities, but also some distinct changes. It's amazing. Especially Look as the that. footage nears the morning light, the object is all but transparent, but emits red glowing lights, showing that it's the same size and oh, shape as before. Wow. So this UFO was time. witnessed many times, but didn't always make an appearance every night. It's been proven that the object and the lights weren't a cruise ship or any other boat, as there were none in the area and it's oh. too high above the horizon for that anyway. Every analyst right who there, has investigated right and scrutinized... There they are, there's our heads, right there. I mean, that's them. This is some kind of trap door or something. You know, that opened up. But this is their ship right here. And that's them right there. Howdy, y'all. Welcome to Earth. Glad you can make it. It's about damn time. Only took you a millennia or two. All right, then. Well, since you're here, grab a plate. Let's eat. The videos has come away with no real answer for it. All admitting uh -huh. that the footage has not been tampered with and is completely <laughs> genuine. But what the footage is showing is anyone's guess. Could it be an odd trick of the light that just happened to repeat on certain days for three years? Or could well, it be extraterrestrials it visiting the Earth with an unexplained allure to the middle dippy of this shit. Turkish sea? Dippy, Whatever dippy, it is, dippy, it's extremely interesting and the top of my list. Deputy shipper brains. And that's it from all top fives for this week. Well, thank you. Do you have any personal vote? Hey, thank you all for watching. I really appreciate your uh, commitment to my channel. And uh, thank you so much for the comments that I've been getting. And and for the bad comments I've been getting. I'll try to do my best on those. Uh, but thank you everyone uh, for uh, hanging out with me today. And I hope you had fun. I hope you uh, laughed a little bit. And please press that subscribe button. That would help me out tremendously. And I could get to the top of the YouTube Empire! So, thank you very much, and I will see you on the next one. Yo!